Hi there, here's a solar dehydrator some friends asked me to make. It's 18 inches wide and 48 inches long. I'll show you how I made it. But please watch the whole video because I'm not recommending it. That's a Luan bottom to hold it all together. And then it's lined with styrofoam, one inch on the bottom, half inch on the sides. And it's held together with one by twos, with drywall screws and adhesive. Pretty easy to make. I've lined it with uh, black flashing, aluminum flashing which is going to heat it up and I just screwed it here and there where it needed to and put some adhesive under the flashing to hold it in place. Here's some aluminum draw slides which I cut up and there's a stopper there to stop it from falling through. I'm not recommending it because it's very hard to, to work with. Here's some um, twin wall polycarbonate for the top. I've screwed it down with foam underneath. Um, there's some foam for the top and the bottom, the door. And as you can see there's a door, it's a one by two with some mesh over it. Um, there's the bottom. I just screwed that on with two screws so it can be removed to clean the thing in case you need to. And there's the view from the bottom looking up through the collector. Um, there's some adhesive on the mesh to make sure the critters don't get in. Critters cannot get into this. You mustn't let them. There's a screw to position the door on the top of it. And there's how the door goes on. It, it, it sits on the screw and then you use hook and eye to hold it on. Now the reason I don't recommend it is you've got to turn it midday to face the sun, you've got to be home to be able to work with this kind of thing. If it's a very humid day, you might not dry all your stuff in one day, but it's great for pre-drying. Here's my prototype. This really worked. As you can see, it actually dried all the tomatoes in one day. It was a nice sunny day and it was 9 to 7 in August, which is very humid. But all I would recommend is to buy an electric one if you work, like I do. It takes me 20 minutes to load up a four tray Excalibur like this. You basically use the exterior of the tomato, all the inside gets thrown away or used for soup or something. One tray, a pound of tomatoes makes one ounce, but they soon add up. And th this is the best way I think if you work to, to dry fruit and veg, especially if you have a big harvest like I do. Good luck.